This game has been plagued with reports of performance issues, which I thankfully did not experience. No, for me it was 60 frames per second of smooth bliss and war crimes. Until I checked the recording. Apparently my performance may well have been a fever dream, as my FPS in the video file plays like a toddler counting to 10. Meaning it gets up to about 6, gets confused and calls the whole thing off. I've never been gaslit by a game before, so I guess this game gets marks for new experiences. With that acknowledged, you can feel free to ostensibly, ironically comment about the frame rate of the footage. I'll be right behind you. Now, onto the premise of this video. There's a faction whose entire shtick is plagues and illness. I felt this rather fitting as I too have succumbed to an illness. Looking at the modifiers, I realised that we could have a bit of fun with attrition here. See, by stacking a few things, you can increase the attrition damage taken by a garrison under siege, basically eliminating the need to fight any battles in a total war game. I, I swear it'll be funny. This went remarkably well, so enjoy the PowerPoint presentation that is to follow, and also enjoy picturing the anguish I felt when realising a three hour recording was basically useless. I reckon we're just gonna go straight ahead and uh, siege this place. Pyrrhic victory. Uh, yeah, something tells me I'm just gonna encircle them and uh, and let them be infected. The hell is this? And more plague. Well, I can't infect them with a plague, can I? We could be boys though. We, we look uh, uh, quite similar. <laughs> There's something so satisfying about just letting them all die. I don't even have to fight them. They can just die on, on just choking on plague. Oh, I'm absolutely going to fight this. What the hell happened to this guy? What is that face? Jesus Christ. I mean, I know he's an ogre and stuff. He's not meant to be pretty, but that is horrible. To be fair, you have been withering away for the last couple of turns. If I somehow lose this battle, I, I think I'll delete the channel. Oh, those poor bastards. Look how few troops they have left. You know what? Let's just let's just sit back. We're just gonna we're just gonna let our lord take care of this. To be fair, at least we're fighting them and not just committing war crimes. Although having said that, those two things aren't mutually exclusive. We can definitely commit war crimes whilst fighting them. We lost uh 17 people. I don't think they they didn't do any kills. I think we just killed our own guys. You want you want me to give you 14,000? What uh the result in war? Sure, buddy. That you're a very long way away for someone who's threatening that. And secondly, you have to march through all of my lands, constantly taking attrition. Good, good luck. That's what we're built for. Let's go back. Again, man, I'm just going to keep retreating. I don't know. Oh, God. Well, time to fight this, I suppose. I don't want to have to fight battles. My entire strategy is predicated on not fighting battles. This feels like a natural place to mention that, like you might have seen already, the battle footage runs somewhat smoothly in comparison to the campaign footage, which is cosplaying as a stroke victim. Super glad I made a video on avoiding battles. Right, they're attacking us, which means they have to come to us. So we can uh, select our ground a little bit tactically here, considering they have, well, I've never seen such high ground in my life. This guy has such massive range. It seems almost like a shame to not pull back a little bit more. And remember, the more damage we take, the more powerful we get. Oh, that's a, that's a lot of arrows. Uh, yeah, let's pull out of there. Are they really not going to fight me? Because they, they wanted this. I don't, I'm, I'm not charging up to see. Okay, nope. Yep, they're coming to me. Right now, we're taking fire. All right, I think it's time. All right, Nuggles. <laughs> so outnumbered. We're going in, boys. We're just going to try and hit the center and try to cause a mass rout. That's that's all I got. Go and flank out here. Go and flank out here. Let's go. Uh, big guy, you're going to need to go and smash him. All right, everyone dogpile on the, on the leader. We might actually have a chance here. I think we might have done this, boys. At a massive cost, but I think we might have done it. Oh, I can't wait to incubate you lot. That was hideously successful. Look at this lot. Look how they move. It's horrifying. This guy gently waddling away. Oh, it's like a, a horde. It's awful. All right, turn around. Mob him. Mob him, boys. We only lost 179, and they lost uh, most of their army. The big guy getting in 239 kills, and we're going to incubate the captives. I don't know how I'm going to deal with all this stuff. I'm just going to figure it out. That's the fun part about this game. There's so many different units. You've just got to figure out how they all slot together. So he's assaulted the garrison, which has done how much damage? Oh, my God. You almost killed an entire unit. There's a hero thing that you essentially start with that can assault garrisons prior to sieging them. So you can see why I was excited by this. He's, I'm a nerd. What's this? A non-aggression pact in return for you giving me money. <laughs> no, I want to fight everyone. The more I fight, the more plagues I can do. Oh no, man. This, uh, this ain't going to go well for you. This is my chance to sort of figure out how to use this stuff. Try and save our units a little bit. Yeah, there he is. The big boy himself. How you doing, buddy? Your name is going to be Dave. All right, Dave, go kill. Oh, would you look at that victory? That might have been the easiest battle I've ever fought in Total War. Did we even take any losses? We took zero losses. My God. Oh, look at those intubations. Oh, we get to fight them again? Oh, please. More plague stuff? 40% go. Oh, you did it. Critical success. Go on, Valpus, you legend. So it's gonna be plus 70% attrition under siege. Oh, yes. Chance of plague spreading, plus 20%. Yes, please. 
<laughs> this is so bad. All right, we're gonna get this guy ready in position because Karak Doom is got quite a significant garrison. Um, it's just a shame that they're about to be infected with plus 70% attrition. <laughs> oh god, I forgot. Whoa! That's right, the feathery scaly bastards had marched from god knows where without me realizing. Meaning I missed out on all that juicy attrition. Once again, screwing over the video theme. <laughs> That's not good. That's bad. That's horrific. Okay, we need to get another army. Nurgling's always good. Right, we don't make nearly as much money. But to be fair, I was rolling this entire place with only one army. Oh, not again. So that is a smart move from the AI to just hide in the corner. I didn't know the AI did corner strats. I used to do this back in uh, Rome 1. You used to do a little pike box with the Macedons, just in a corner. My god, boys, just get in there, please. Ah, oh, he's actually gonna die. My entire strategy is predicated on the ability to keep this guy alive. I don't know if I just discovered the word predicated, but believe me when I say I've cut six of them from the footage already. Also, shortly after a hard fought battle, my game crashed. Insultingly, the auto resolve actually fared better than I did. Jesus, how many did we lose? We lost like 300. We wiped out everyone though. God damn, I don't know what calculations went into that for me to wipe out their entire army. Uh, yeah, let's get a brain eating disease. We've murdered a dwarf. And we've got more plague infections. Okay, good. All right, go on, spread the plague. And that means that when we siege them, they're gonna have 70% attrition. Oh, we're suffering attrition, so this isn't gonna get any easier. The fact that I have more units um, and the game thinks I'm going to get smashed really worries me. So we got reinforcements coming in two minutes. Uh, what do these guys do? Oh, great. A lot of ranged attacks. The thing I'm weak against. Brilliant. I think it's probably a good idea if we uh, back the hell up over to like here. There we go. In your own time, boys. How are we all doing? Yeah, all here? All good? This is a lot of troops. This is like kind of an intimidating amount of units. You know what? Let them have the high ground. It's not worth my willpower to try and uh, try and get this game to obey me. Honestly, I reckon the best chance we have is just, weirdly enough, a frontal assault. I mean, I reckon for the visuals, we just, we just sort of, you know? Jesus Christ. I, I have realized now that I've decided to march headfirst into a bunch of uh, uh, ranged units. Uh, that's not a good idea, is it? Considering the sheer amount of clumping that's going on. Oh boy. All right, and then you lot, your entire job is to take out this dude. You can't? Okay, great. We don't have any range, do we? So he's just gonna sit there and murder us. All right, we just gotta hope that these boys can all clump together to take out this one guy. A missile monster, I don't like the look of that. Straight to the back of them boys. Go on, Nurglings, it's all on you. We just gotta kill this dude. Kairos fate with he's poison. Take him out, please. I'm trying to get my wing thingies to fight this chariot. What does that mean? What's what's going on here? He's walking through our ranks, boys. Don't let him walk through you like that. Get up. Why are you down? Get up. Yeah, we took it out. We took out the chariot. Go. Take out whatever the hell this is. He's wounded. Oh my god, we took him out. Go. Finish them. Take out Soul Grinder. It's on full health. I don't know what Soul Grinder is, but just kill it. Oh my god, there's so much going on here. There is. There is so much going on here. So why are the frames stable? 10,000 Nurglings getting tossed around is no problem, but six characters on a map and OBS goes on strike. If it feels like I'm talking about this a lot, it's because I'm trying to distract you from the poor visuals. Audience retention 101. Oh god, that's terrifying. I don't oh, Jesus! My nerglings! Oh. My. God. We did it, boys. We defended our territory. We killed every single one of them. God, there's these flying things that did a lot of the damage. I need to look more into them then. Look at that. Obviously, we're gonna intubate the captives. Well, there are no captives, really. But we'll intubate them anyway. Oh no. It's spread over here. <laughs> oh god, I'm spreading it. I don't even know where those bird things live. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Well, now I know where he lives. Ooh, new stuff. Plague duration, obviously. Uh, and we want some attrition. More attrition. And we're going to get another plague cultist over here. This suit, actually, this feels overkill to, to do it to this lot. Eh. The Claire War. Yeah, I, I don't know who you are. I'm just going to take you out. All right, Bleeding Spire is the next target. What the hell are you? Oh, bloody hell. Okay, well, I think Storm. Storm Rax, I think, uh, probably, probably is pretty screwed. For some reason, I really fixated on this Ragnar chap, and I made it my main aim to make his life miserable. I can't actually remember why. The thing is, he's gonna take this province, right? Or he's not? My entire plan was that he takes this province, but it's already got plague, so it would just cause more issues for him. You fool! The Skullbringers of Corn Rebels. Why? I'm sieging here. Armor and shielded. That's, that's terrifying for us. Okay, they seem to be splitting up. I think we hit him now. We have more troops. Let's, uh, let's do it. And, oh, right. We've got our mountain boys. Go, I don't know, do something. Do something impressive. Ooh, that's a bit of damage right on the big guy. There we go. That should be it. 
Jesus Christ. Well, the game thought we were going to lose that. I don't know how. But we did take a fifth of our armies in damage, and we lost two really good units, or three really good units. Still, he's taking attrition and we're not, so I suppose that's that's always the idea. What servant the hell are you? Only of the murder god. Yeah, well, servant of, you're gonna get kicked in the face by this dude pretty soon. Come on, Valpus, off you go. Chance of plague spreading. All armies faction-wide plus 50%. Oh, please. You can't tease me like that. Just one dude, we've only got one hero and he's, dude, he's just murdering everything, it's great. Might be worth getting another army, to be honest. And maybe a beast of Nurgle. There we go. And suddenly, there's just a random ass uh, army here. Congratulations, you got played. <laughs> again, man, just bring your bird asses back here and I'll send you back packing again. Literally, all you did was turn up and get absolutely destroyed. Why, why would I go? Oh, what the hell is this? Oh, no. Oh, 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 God. I'm gonna auto resolve that and everyone is dead. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. Suddenly, I remember why. There you go. So now he's suffering, uh, oh god, every turn, only time may rhythm in this malady, how long do they have it for? This was my plan, by the way, this is, this is the entire plan for the video, they've got six turns, so they're gonna lose about 300 troops each time, which is gonna wipe them out. I mean, this was the entire plan, I was just gonna have like a bunch of overpowered plagues and let people attack me, but it's been so successful that we're just letting, we're, just, we're, we're the ones attacking. Oh, Jesus. No, look, no, buddy, no, Ragnar, Ragnar, Ragnar. I'm enjoying watching you suffer way too much. I don't need peace. I need more bodies to test on. I'm just following this guy around now just to see the damage it's doing. Look at it. <laughs> oh my god, his army's been decimated. Probably fight it, but uh, that's not my way. Uh, for those of you who haven't clued in yet, I'm going to be waiting for this one to fall because it also has my plague. And uh, we're going to go go in and, uh, and take them out as well. We started at strength, like, ranking of 56 or something. Really risen up the <laughs> the leaderboard. <laughs> Ragnar's absolutely legging it. He's tried to go back into his own territory to try and stop this. <laughs> Little does he know, he might even be spreading it himself. Oh, incredible. Oh, finally he started to replenish his troops, but look at the damage it did. Remember when you just recovered? Probably went and got uh, new, uh, new men. Ah, uh, yeah. That's uh, so worth it. <laughs> and it's highly infectious. Hopefully it affects the other army as well. Oh, look at that. Six turns of this. He's got to do it again. He spread the plague back into this into this goddamn settlement. Why would you do that? Oh, Ragnar, this was a mistake. Oh, buddy. Well, Ragnar, I've been chasing you across the map. It's finally time. What? What? Oh, that's filth. And Ragnar's dead. <laughs> the only thing left to do is to go and take out the province he was defending. Oh no, I'm not even at war with you and you caught the plague, you idiot. Mind you, you lot, you probably used to things like the clap, aren't you? I'm outside your gate, man. I don't think this is a good time. So what's the time? It does look like it's plague o'clock. Oh, well that'll do. And everyone's dead. And we've taken the settlement. I think that's that faction destroyed. Well, that seems like a natural place to end the video. <laughs> well, lads, uh, I guess... Thank you very much for watching. If you've, uh, if you've enjoyed this video, and uh, particularly the audacity ending, please make sure to like and subscribe. It really does help us out. Otherwise, I'll see you all next time. Goodbye. Shout out to our Patreons. Shadowsinger, Jado52, Cargan, Flyerton, Henrique, Redguard76, and Xiaomi. Your support means a lot, guys.